Good morning and hope you all have been well. In today's video, we are going to be continuing on with our Pokemon Rejuvenation Intense Mode, No Items Let's Play, and this is part 63 of the Let's Play just to let you guys know. Uh, so yeah, so I guess with that, we shall continue on. So what's your plan, Alita? Well, I was thinking that we could, out of the way, leave this to the professionals. I'll make quick work of this stupid gate, just you wait. And you're the professional? Somehow, I don't think that's quite right. What's your plan then, Adam? I, the Adam might, will break down this gate with my raw strength. Hey, I think that's a great idea. Is it though? I don't know. Last time you tried something like this, you... I forgot. You don't remember that happening. It'll work, trust me. Now this I gotta see. Poor Adam, bro. One day you'll get a W. Adam, I'm dead. I knew something stupid like that was gonna happen, I just knew it. Even without his memories, his, he's still the same Adam, sorry. Adam, are you okay? Physically, yes. Emotionally, I'm in shambles. Hey, I feel much better. Emotionally, too. Remind me to sign your forehead later. That'll be m that'll be my thanks to you. Why did the gate open, th though? Sorry. Because I opened it. Managed to get behind the gate and find the lever. Oh, who's this chick now? They're coming in drones. That's Reza Raider. She's a friend of ours. Uh, Hugh, you're too cute. But, um, there's something I gotta show you guys. Could you guys come this way real quick? Uh, sure. Um, now listen. I'm all about adventure and all on that... Piss, I read that all wrong. Let me redo that. Now listen, I'm all about adventure and all of that stuff, but... Think this in particular might be a little out of my comfort zone. This is a nuke. This, this thing can't be real. Out in the open. Isn't that just insane? That's not all. Take a look at the letters engraved on it. Do any of you recognize that alphabet? I can't say I've ever seen anything like that. They look very similar to, to the unknown letters, but not quite. Yeah, you're right, Zenboy. There's a lot of evidence that states that the alphabets were modeled after the unknown. Perhaps this text is that in a more primitive form primitive this is a bomb how could this thing ever that was my th thought too but my curiosity got the better of me wait what are you crazy why would you do something like that relax this thing is truly totally hollow sorry there's nothing inside honestly i don't think anything ever was but it's interesting to think about isn't it why was this made who made this it doesn't matter what if it wasn't what if it went off what then I have my methods, I wouldn't do something that would endanger people. Just asking you to trust me on that one for now. Anyway, that's all I wanted to show you. There's not much else besides this empty shell. Who knows, maybe this thing is just the context you'll need for later. Context for later? Can you stop being such a vague person? Oh my gosh, what is with this hostility? I've done nothing but help you guys since you got here, right? I was going to let you guys just find it on your own, so you feel accomplished or, or whatever. But now I'm gonna spoil it. Just kidding, it's not a spoiler. It's valuable info for Ren, Arrow, and Alita. That rift you're looking for is just up ahead. It was guarded by some Blade Star grunts, but I took care of them. It's all yours, so have fun with that or whatever. The rift maybe will make it after all. I'll leave that to you guys. I'll catch up with you guys later or not. So if what Riza said is true, then we finally found our target. Yeah, let's be quick about this, we don't have a lot of time. In that case, we'll be returning to the ship, and we'll wait for its defeat. Yeah, good luck you guys. Everyone's counting on you three. Yeah. Arrow, if you lose to this thing, I'll have to beat you up. Because that also means that I'm weak, I cannot accept my imperfections. So you go get them. I think that's his weird way of saying good luck. I think I liked him more when he was quieter. 
Wait, that was so mean. I'm sorry. Oh, don't worry. I'll just tell him you said that once this is all over. Wait, I said I'm sorry. Big bro moment. I also kind of wonder, how does this even play out in the story? I guess there's an item there too. I'll take that. I'll take this too. But I'm not sure. I wonder if they'll ever go into that in the future. Um, enough of me being dumb though. Uh, let me go through this real quick. Alright, sorry for the pause there. Uh, but anyways, um, let's see here. That's right, um, I want you, you don't do anything. I already tried Noivern before, it just doesn't do anything. You don't do anything, I tried you as well. You definitely don't. You definitely don't. I know I tried a few ideas, um, the one recording I've done of this, but this one I want to do something a little bit different. So I want to bring you as well, because I like the idea of Ren and I both going for parting shot. I want, that's right, I brought you. I brought um, you, because you had Yawn, right? Yeah, I do want you. I tried Toxic before, but I kind of learned that it is a poison type, so I do want to put it to sleep. Um, but we're going to lead with you, of course. And what's the final Pokemon? You, because you have um, Acid Spray, right? I want to try him out. So this guy's kind of new, and I believe... Actually, I tried the Pangoro before. I swapped it out to try a few different things, but I think this time I'm going to bring it back and see if that might work. And I want to see if um, lowering the special defense would be useful. So you're kind of new. I want to keep you though. And I think that's it. Because I know my original team, I believe it was, um, instead of Solrock, I had, um, Feraligator. Instead of Garbodor, I had some other water type, I think. And I kept trying to do that, but I noticed I just was not breaking this thing at all. Because this thing is incredibly bulky. Uh, but after losing quite a few tries, I kind of decided to watch how Ren played against it. So I think going back to the parting shot idea is a decent idea um, that I was trying with the one recording that I did delete. So I'm going to bring that back. Um, I know once you break the shields, it has a, um, a black sludge, which my Alolan Muk, as long as we get the special attack and, and attack drops, I should be able to take a hit, get rid of that with knockoff, and if I can take another hit, depending on what happens within the game, I can go for a memento as well, if I can pull that off. I know I also want um, the Soul Rock with Fire Spin. I noticed that, um, whatchamacallit, his Rose Raid was going for Sand Tomb, and it did constant uh, chip damage, so I think stuff like Fire Spin and Sand Tomb is going to be useful for breaking the shield over time. It's a similar idea for what I've done with the Gardevoir. The first time we battled Gardevoir, I believe I used Fire Spin as well to break the shield. So, um, I think that could be useful as well for this one. But anyways, there's only one way to find out. There it is, that's our target. Finally, after all of this time, it's smaller than I thought it would be. Looks like a Hippowdon. The tubes on its body are spewing out sand endlessly. Alright, so what's the plan? Present the weird diary. Huh, what's this? Ren and Alita both went through the diary. So basically, what I've gathered is that it is possible to save this thing. But the question is, are we, are we equipped to do something like this? Maybe Anastasia might have something to 
say about this. Would it matter? The book says a chamber is needed to drain out the rift matter. Unfortunately, even if the stage was shown this earlier, we wouldn't have the means to do anything about it. What's up, Adano? Oh, right, thanks. Adano, do you want to try healing it yourself? I don't think that'll work. Besides, I know I keep saying it, but we don't have the time. Every second we waste could mean the worst. Yeah, I'm sorry, Adano. Just set this one out with me. Right, so the only choice we have here is to destroy it. Yeah, it's unfortunate. So then, should I do it? Hippowdon's a ground type. My Cherim and Starmie make a good combo. I think Arrow and I should handle this one. This was our original mission after all. Got it. Adano and I will act as a backup then. Good luck. Sorry Hippowdon, but this is necessary. Let's go. Okay, hopefully we, we can do this. Alright, so let's do this again like I did last time. Parting shot. I want to go into Billy. Go for Yawn because Toxic won't work. I think I gotta go into you, right? Because if I can get special defense drops, and the main reason for that, even though it is incredibly uh, bulky, if I can just get a few defense drops, or special defense drops, I think that'll be useful for Water Plate with Hydro, and the Greninja with, um, I think it has Scald or Hydro Pump, something like that. So I think those two combined are able to take it out. Possibly. We'll have to see how it goes though. Okay, so we're able to take a hit because of the two drops that we got earlier. Go for Acid Spray. Hopefully it stays asleep for a few turns. Three turns would be great. There we go. One more. There we go. Alright, I'm out. Okay. Going to you now. Uh, cosmic power. I just want to do that so I can take hits better. Now I'll go for fire spin. Okay. Solar Flare again. Okay. Fire Spin. Don't need you. Maybe I need a Parting Shot more. Well, actually, why can't I just yawn here? Hmm. What's it at? No, I got a hard swap. No, I have to. It's the right play. Because it goes to sleep. I have to get rid of its item. Can't I just memento? Oh, it don't matter. Okay. I'm having a bro moment. Big bro moment. I remember uh, it took. God, it took me such a long time. The first time going through it.
I don't know how you get through this without just lowering its stats that many times with like parting shot or honestly you could probably even do something that lowers the defense quite a bit instead of special defense and I think the same thing would possibly happen. I just think special defense is better though because of Ren's team. He has a Greninja, um, but then again he does have a few decent physical attackers. Well not even decent, like great physical attackers because what is it, Arcanine, Scizor, uh, Rose Raid is decent as well. He's actually got quite a bit of good stuff. I don't know though, I don't know. There might be a way to like really cheese this thing and just be really creative, but... Well, I guess the way we did do it was kind of cheese, kind of not. I don't know, honestly. Uh, it don't matter. Let's continue on. We won. I'm, I'm running with it. Uh, this thing still isn't down. We've been fighting for ages. I don't know how much longer we can keep going. I don't know what's the matter. I don't know what are you doing. Why are you healing it? Seriously, you're not helping. Just go wait with Alita, please. It's okay. We know you're only trying to help. Just leave this window to us, okay? We'll do this together. You're gonna need my help. <laughs> ah, didn't know. Ren, I'm gonna need you to... Huh. What's going on? Whoa. Big bro moment. The Hippowdon, it's it's back to normal. I guess this is the power of Mega Adeno. I don't know, that was incredible. Oh no, I guess it used up the last of its strength and its mega form to heal Hippowdon. Yay, this had a happy ending after all. It seems like the sandstorm has subsided as well, Ren. We should contact Nastasia, Ren. She probably already noticed though. Yeah, I'll do it just in case. Nastasia, the sandstorm should have subsided subsided by now, sorry. I noticed good job on destroying that rift. Actually, we didn't destroy it. Adono came through for us and used a, a mega heal pulse. It looks like it drained the rift matter from its body. It's perfectly fine. I didn't know Adono were capable of pulling off something that grand. That's interesting, very interesting. Coincidentally, it seems like Team B and C have all made it back. We'll be making our way to a skill of pyramid immediately. Only we only have one we only have four hours left, sorry. Gotcha, then we'll start heading towards the pyramid ourselves. See you later, Nastasia. Soon, soon this will all be over. Uh Braxton, I was just about to call you. I'm almost done with the translator, but we should be but we should do a quick test run. There try saying something. Something. It works perfectly. No it doesn't. It'll short out after like five minutes. I got to work on that, so give it back. Before that, I need you to make something for me. Please listen carefully. Step one complete. Good job team. Yeah, Adeno was the MVP this time around. Sorry I didn't believe in you earlier. As a result though, Adeno is no longer in its mega form. I can still I still can't use Mega Evolution. So I'm not sure if Adeno will be able to heal us as efficiently as she used to. It just means we gotta be more careful. Only four hours remain, we're at the final stretch. Let's move. Big bro moment. There are a few paths we can take. South is blocked off by the rubble, and it looks like there's a bridge to the left. If we're looking for a pyramid, I doubt we'll be approaching the ocean. Yes, besides, I know for a fact that the bridge doesn't lead to the pyramid. You do? How? Because across that bridge is Relidan Island, the island where Team Zen HQ is located. Zen HQ, Team Zen's base of operations. If your base is here, then why didn't we just land there instead of Zone Zero? Couple of reasons. The biggest reason being that uh, this mission isn't exactly authorized. This mission isn't authorized. You mean Astasia's breaking the rules by helping us out? Essentially, yes. 
Madame X has no idea what we're doing right now, which is, um, dangerous. Yeah, no kidding. That being said, there's only one way left to go. I'm going to, I'm going to hope that's where we have to go. Despite being on Relidan Island often, I never actually, actually leave the building much. One can only hope. I guess we'll take a look at the, um, the Zen base, which was the old, um, rejuvenation building if I'm not mistaken I also gotta say I don't know if it's just me but I've always been a big fan of the Team Zen um, theme music there's no way I'm letting you pass this point you might be strong in other places but you're on our turf now get lost for a moment all right, let's continue on. To our dear friend Anna, may you rest peacefully forever. Uh, hold on there, Arrow. You remember what's up ahead, right? I found you unconscious here, unconscious here all the way back when, sorry. Will you be okay this time around? I'll be okay. Okay in that case. What's this house doing all the way out here? I just gotta say this real quick before continuing. I really hope, which, um, I don't see why they wouldn't, but I really do hope in the future they do a thing, maybe like a side quest or like a secret thing or something that you're able to go into the house and hopefully like there's some cool story flashback stuff you know with this um i mean like i i know technically this is a flashback yes but actually going into the house and like seeing a few more memories i i think it would be very very cool um or something of the sort like that i think it would be cool plus then again I am a very big fan of all of the protagonists. They are, uh, technically, I'm just going to count them as one. They're in my, um, I would say they're in my top five uh, favorite uh, characters in Rajuve. I, I just can't pick one above the other. I, I, I think all of them are just really cool. And I really love how technically all of them have their own um, different themes, I guess is how you word it. Or maybe personalities, because what is it? Avius is, uh, what, bravery, um, Avia is tranquility, um, Arya here, I believe, is happy, or happiness, um, Axel is chaos, if I'm not mistaken, Alon is wrath, Arrow is strength, and Anna is mercy. I think I got that right maybe if i'm wrong you can correct me but i've always thought that was really cool that they did that for the characters or for the pro tags it's really cool all right and en enough of me rambling on i'm trying to take a nap axel could you come back later oh yeah and get yelled at later for not waking you up as if drama queen we gotta go i guess this is why we're related always gotta be punctual after all it's Avia's piano recital today, isn't it? That's right, you dork. She's been practicing for months, so let's not be late. Yep, you're right, let's get going. Hmm, there it is, that devilish smile of yours. What have you done this time, Axel? Oh, nothing, my dear, dear sister. I'm an angel, don't you know that already? Oh, by the way, Alon said... I did not mean to skip that, sorry. I believe it says something of the sort that Alon said your cookies were stale or burnt or something. I didn't mean to skip that, sorry. She said what? Did you tie my shoelaces together? That's what you get for embarrassing me in front of everyone the other day. Eye for an eye, sis. I'll see you at the recital. Don't be late or else Avia will be upset. You nerd. You won this time, but next time I'll get you. Axel. Arrow? Arrow, are you okay? What's going on? Arrow's been acting weirdly weird lately, especially around these parts. You doing okay? 
Well, we definitely gotta go with the fine, okay? I feel that. Me too. I'm exhausted. Anyway, those Bladestar grunts said they were heading towards the pyramid too. Right? We're stronger as a team. We can do this. Big bro moment. Looks like we finally made it. Yeah, Nastasia seems to have made quick work getting here too. If any more preparations need to be done, we should do them now. How are you guys holding up? I don't really get tired that often in this body, so I'm good. Guess that's one perk of being an android. One of many, I keep asking Nastasia for a milkshake option. But alas, even if I had such a feature, I wouldn't be able to enjoy it. I still would be cool for everyone else though. Maybe we should all get milkshakes at Mika's cafe when this is all over. I like that. Oh, I did not mean to skip that, sorry. Uh, sorry about that again. But we have to save them first, yes? Affirmative arrow, when you're, whenever you're ready, meet us inside. What do you sell? Uh, nothing I really need. And you? Are those pipes coming out of the ground? Does this pyramid have a plumbing system? Um, I don't think anybody's in here, but it's worth a try. Yeah, no, nobody's up here. I don't know why I'm gonna check up here, but... Yeah, I was about to say it's locked. Okay. So this is the scale of pyramid. This place looks exactly how I thought it would. Actually, everything checks out. Yeah, and if those reports from Nastasia came out correct, that means the spring of rejuvenation should be on the bottom floor. So we gotta look for the stairs going. Hello and welcome to Eskela Pyramid. Huh, what's that? Thank you for choosing Eskela Pyramid as your destination. We are happy to announce that you are our 56th, 57th, and 58th visitor of the day. If you're looking for the Spring of Rejuvenation, please head straight. If you're, if you're interested in visiting our sky deck, please make the next right. Once again, thank you for choosing Eskela Pyramid and have a wonderful day. I didn't just imagine that, right? No, you definitely didn't. That was weird. We're in a pyramid, not a supermarket. What's with the announcer? I get that that's re re piss. rhetorical, sorry, but also I have absolutely no idea. And it only counted three of us. Why not all four? We can talk all about it. We could talk about it later over those milkshakes. Yes. Yeah. Back on track. Come on. Uh, bro moment. Sorry for reading that wrong, most likely. Now let's continue on. Looks like you guys made it after all. Yeah, it took a bit of work, but we came around. I wouldn't celebrate just yet. There's a problem. Problem? What's the problem? I believe you may want to speak to Nastasia about that. It's very horrifying. Ellie, you know what? You do you, Ellie. But yeah, um, you should go speak with Nastasia. It's kind of serious. Nastasia, what's the... Oh. The spring? It's, it's completely dried out. But I don't... This can't be real. What are we supposed to do now that the spring is dry? Nastasia, please say something. What do we do now? Okay, I'll say something. Be quiet. I'm trying to think because, because for once, I don't know where to go from here. Ah, seeing as the other two springs are functional, I didn't anticipate this outcome, but it, but it was naive of me to think that this wouldn't be a possible result, result, sorry. Maybe there's a way to get to the spring back up and running. There must be a new way, or must be a way, sorry. And I guess our character's having a bro moment. And looking at the pod status timer, we only have an hour and a half left. An hour and a half to search this entire pyramid head to toe. We need a miracle to... Do you see this water addressed? It's different. Can you tell? 
It certainly looks cleaner than the water you see above ground. That's right. This water holds healing properties that humanity deemed impossible to exist. But because of the material we've gathered from that meteorite, the impossible is now possible. We've refined its contents and created an object we're labeling the Jewel of Life. Uh, so we've came up with a name for it then. Where is it being held? We've constructed this pyramid specifically to maintain the spring, but the jewel is being held on the sky view, which is on the highest level. Remove the jewel and the spring will stop running. But why would we want to remove the jewel in the first place? With this spring, we'll be able to live here together for a very long time. Immortality, in theory, could be in reach, as long as we stay in contact with the spring. But there will come a time where us, as humans, are ready to move on. And when that fated day comes, fated day comes, the jewel will be removed. Mother. Forgive me, ma'am. I meant Vera. It's okay, addressed. It was nice to finally hear you call me mother. As you have already concluded, the spring has been drained. Arrow? But that voice, it's different. I realize this may be quite strange, but I'm going to need you all to listen to me. The spring can be reactivated, there's still time. On the highest level there is a room called the sky view. All we must do is reinsert the jewel into the pillar there. Once that's done, the spring will flow once more. But it's a long journey to the top, we must make our way there immediately. I uh... If that's the case, then you three will make your way to the top. But Nastage, I don't want to hear it. We're at rock bottom. Do as Arrow says and get to the sky view. Yes ma'am. Affirmative. I don't know who or what you are, but I'll figure it out. Until then, we have work to do. So get to it, yes? Ah, uh, my friends, do you want to play again? Yes, let's play together, just like old times. For a moment. Hey, Arrow, over here. You may be wondering how I got here. It's a really funny story. You see, we got impatient. Which led to the bridges being broken, the whole drama. Shouldn't be a problem though, let's just work together to progress as usual. We have these cool gadgets to communicate whenever we need to. I'll just skip that. And you know what? We'll do all of that next episode. We're 33 minutes in. I, I don't want a super long episode this time. We beat, we beat the rift. Next episode we'll go through the pyramid. We might do the Rylan battle next episode most likely if not it'll most definitely be the next next episode so yeah again thanks so much for watching definitely do appreciate it and i will see you guys in the next episode good morning